Biodynamic Farming How to Achieve a Garden of Eden? Imagine if you could have the world's best compost for your garden without wasting money on expensive compost bins or tumblers, without the smells and the headaches. Imagine a veritable garden of Eden in your backyard where the food tastes out of this world, plants thrive and diseases and pests cease to exist because for once your plants are actually healthy and growing the way nature intended. Is your garden all it could be? You may have tried conventional composting methods and still not achieved the results you desire. You may have found it hard and time-consuming to make enough compost to go around. Maybe you dumped loads of fertilizers or other products on your garden that the experts recommended to try to give your garden what it was lacking. Is there something missing? Most of us can see our garden is lacking something but we don't know what. We just know our plants are not growing or producing as well as they could. So taking a shotgun approach, hoping to find that elusive something, we dump on all kinds of stuff the experts recommended. The experts are wrong. Most of what experts teach about composting and feeding plants is totally wrong and you are actually killing them with kindness and making them sicker. Plants feed two ways. One is through introduction of nutrients to soil moisture this is how our natural systems like hydroponics or most fertilizers whether organic or chemical work. They create feast or famine conditions in your garden. The result is an excess in nutrient concentrations that the plants can't totally use all at once, in some cases chemical burn is the result. Excess nutrients also contaminate our groundwater. Then scarcity comes as fertilizer and this form quickly leaches away. There is a better way. Plants have another preferred and natural way of feeding that is largely ignored. This is by humus and colloidal form in the soil. Colloids are much like jello. These colloids resist leaching and provide a stable source of nutrients as a plant requires them. Here is what's missing. But most garden soils are devoid of these colloids. That is because most compost made at home is just soil and nothing more. It is not really humus and certainly not colloidal humus. But by harnessing the secrets of biodynamic farming it is possible to make compost rich in colloidal humus that is unlike anything you have seen or used before. Gardening season is fast approaching. Don't risk another mediocre garden season without finding out more about the world's best biodynamic compost. Find out how to transform your garden to a place of bounty and vibrant health by clicking the link below this video today.